guys, my name is Ross Tran. Welcome to another episode of Ross Draws. Today's gonna be an awesome episode because I love Avatar. Avatar is one of my favorite series. When I was in high school, I used to watch all the season on my Zoom. You remember the Microsoft Zoom things that no one uses anymore? I had three of them and Zach stole them all. What? Oh, Zach, yeah. if you're watching this, you owe me a Microsoft Zoom. I knew you stole it. We're gonna do Korra today. Ooh, Ooh. So let's set the mood. Ooh. A bit, bit chilly in here. Ah! I asked a question on what should I put in my fridge and some of the most popular answers were ice cream, desserts, frozen yogurt. So, uh, let's go get some! French vanilla. Let's see what we get. Strawberry. Rocket pop sorbet. Make some magic out of this. Blueberries. Awesome. Oreos. And, uh, mochi. 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 Yeah, this is our palette. Let's take a picture of it and I'll check back soon. Hey guys, uh, welcome back. That was a fun little trip. Afterwards, I took a photo of it, and uh, this is what came out. Delicious frozen yogurt. I'm gonna let the palette and complexities and essence of this overtake my piece. Give Cora some frozen yogurt over here. Oh, yeah. So I think the spoon is uh, in a weird place for a woman, but uh, yeah, let's uh, try to see what we come up with. I'm trying to work on this, and I'll check back soon. Santa's little helper. Santa's little helper. We're Santa's little helper. We make the hey guys, welcome back. Yeah, this is the progress that we started with. You know, we built on top, we sculpted, we used the palette. I think uh, Cora looking delicious. Get it? No? Yes? You do get it. Okay, uh, let's give uh, Naga some eyes. Yay! Features! I'm gonna show you a painting method I really like to use called dabbing. I use dabbing to create more texture, and I thought right here would be a perfect way to showcase that. Start with something darker, you know, something mid-tone and darker right here. Take a lighter color, and I would kind of just dab my brush in. You know, it creates like a fur texture. That really simple technique can really just add texture to your piece. Also, I really like to show you guys how uh, I light the face. So what I would do is just hit it where the light is. Right there. Angle, like that. You can see, you know, we have our nice foundation base to start with. And then we just kind of added on top and sculpted it around. So uh, I'm going to try to keep working on it. And I'll check back soon. Uh, welcome back. Yeah, this is the progress of the piece. I'm really excited because I think it's looking really cool actually. You know, we built on top from what we had. Find the face a little more, add some details over here, and add this nice little power thing. And most importantly, we took out that unfortunate spoon. <laughs> I want to talk a little bit about hair. I think when we're all starting out, you know, you want to paint each individual hair, and don't lie, we've all done that. All you really need is a dark color and a light color. So we have our dark color here. So all you need to do is kind of follow the flow of the hair, like this. When you're painting hair next time, like, don't go like that. But instead, you know, you just want to kind of follow the flow of the hair, and then we can build on top of it. This whoop thing she has, what I really wanted to do was frame the face so we look there. I'll show you guys how to add effects really efficiently with the line of action. Like that. We just use, like, a debris brush ooh, to follow the line of action, like that. And so that way, it's in a controlled gesture and it has a purpose. Now, she's looking more like a, like the Avatar. <laughs> Break. Oh. <laughs> Cora, it's code on time! <laughs> Avatar mode activated. Are you ready for this? Ah! Avatar mode! Everything changed when the fire nation attacked! <laughs> Grab a scoop of yogurt. Oh yeah. Dodge mode, go the yogurt. Ready for this? Oh. 
I just reached 30,000 subscribers! Ah! Seriously, a genuine thank you, because I just remember, you know, when my mom and her friends are watching it, but now I have all you guys. Yeah. So if you're interested in the in-depth video tutorial, as well as the full-length tutorial for this piece I made for my book. Some of you know I'm working on a book, and here's a piece from it. So if you're interested in all that, come check out my Patreon. Print giveaway winner is Mr. Wesley. Yes, congratulations. This avatar is about balance. This episode's question is, name something you really like about yourself, and then name something you want to work on. You could go like, hey, I think I make fantastic ramen, but I suck at drawing hands. Something like that. And actually cannot wait to get my puppy this weekend. I if you like something you see, please subscribe. And again, thank you guys so much. And uh, shout out to the next five subscribers. Actually, I don't think my mom is subscribed to my channel yet. Mom, subscribe to my channel right now. Cora, Cora, it's ice cream time. Open up. Open up. Come on.